Hey, this is Presh Tollwalker. A version of this question was asked on a Cambridge entrance exam. Of the five grids, one grid is shaded completely correctly. Each of the other four grids has exactly one shaded square wrong. Which grid is correct? Pause the video if you'd like to give this problem a try. And when you're ready, keep watching to learn how to solve this problem. The only way to be completely sure of the answer is to go through each possibility. Let's do that first. Let's first compare grids A and C. Suppose grid A was the correct grid. Then grid C would have exactly one square different from grid A. However, we can see that grid C has two squares that are different from grid A. By the reverse logic, this shows that grid C cannot be the correct grid because if grid C was the correct grid, then grid A would have to have exactly one square different from grid C. So we know that neither A nor C can be the correct answer. Similarly, let's consider if grid B were the answer. Well, in this case, grids B and C differ by two squares. So again, grid B cannot be the answer. What about grid D? Again, grid C differs by two squares from grid D, so D cannot be the answer. This leaves E as the only possibility. In fact, E is the correct answer, and we can check that all of the other four grids differ from grid E by exactly one square. Now just for fun, I want to show another way to solve the problem. Let's overlap these grids on top of each other, and let's make it so that if two grids have squares in the same spot, we'll shade the squares darker. Here's the result when all five grids are placed on top of each other. Now, wherever the squares are darker will be our guess of the correct squares. So this leads to the following guess of what the correct grid would be. Similarly, where the squares are lighter shaded would be the squares that are the ones that are incorrect from the correct grid. We can actually see that these incorrect squares would correspond to the grids A, B, C, and D. These are exactly where those grids differ from grid E. So once again, we can actually see that grid E is the correct grid, and thus the other four are wrong. So E is the correct answer. Thanks for making us one of the best communities on YouTube. See you next episode of Mind Your Decisions, where we solve the world's problems one video at a time.